We're back with Ross Hancock. Now, Ross is from the Results in Business Institute. And on screen, you'll see their website. You'll also see an 0800 number if you want to get in touch with the team uh, to find out more, whether it's growing your own business with them or becoming a licensee. Uh, all the details are on screen. And in fact, that's what we're going to talk a little bit more about today with Ross is what is this licensee side of the business? You know, what is a licensee? How do you become one? And how do you know whether you're going to be a good one? Okay. Well, over the last 22 years, Alice, we've de developed a set of excellent business diagnostic tools for SMEs within Australia and New Zealand. That's small to medium businesses. Okay. Um, they are diagnostic. We have business management systems, and then we have individual systems in all areas of business management, purchasing, sales, marketing, admin, cost control, etc. So we take our licensees virtually as opportunity seekers from all walks of life. Typically these days we're dealing with a lot of baby boomers. Yes, who are yes. Like from my age down, you know, mm. the 60-year-olds down to the 45-year-olds. We've got uh, people that work their business part-time. We, we've got a, a, a young mum in Queensland who's uh, 35 years of age, a couple of kids still at school. She's a lawyer. Mm -hmm. She's opted out of her law business and she's now working three hours a day part-timing as a business consultant to her previous business network. We've got a couple on the South Island here in New Zealand right. that owned a restaurant, had three kids under 10. The restaurant hours just didn't suit the bringing up of three kids, so they sold their restaurant and they bought a license with no previous experience and we've trained them up to be business okay. consultants because of the excellence and the quality of our systems. So we really can train anyone with a bit of commercial experience to use our systems for the betterment of small business. Okay. And as I said to you in a, in a previous uh, chat that we had, Alice, we, we're all about looking at the small stuff. Yes. We, we really do look at the 1% of improvement and we look about going in, identifying where the leakage is in businesses and then fixing it. And our licensees really do come from all walks of life. We've got entrepreneurial young 35-year-old ex-corporate executives that really want to be independent and work you know, 70 yep. hours a week. And we've got part-time baby boomers who have done it all, paid exactly. the mortgage, got the kids off their back. Don't want to work so much. Don't want to work so hard, want to play golf three days a week. <laughs> yeah. and, and they can work the business right. part-time with maybe only five or 10 clients. That's fantastic. Now speaking about clients, how does a licensee find clients? I mean, do you provide assistance there too we, or show them how to go we, about finding yeah. clients? Look, because our systems are, are all about generating business for their clients, our systems obviously yeah. cope with helping them generate their own business. So we generally teach our licensees some business generation techniques that are proven across the way to, to work and they can gain as many clients as they want as fast as they want or just take one new client right. on a month. Uh, should they choose. But as you say, you've got these wonderful systems behind you that enable people, perhaps with little um, knowledge in the area of being a licensee, but, but they've got the commercial interest, yep. you can train them up to become a yep. very, very good licensee yep. that who will in turn help other people grow their businesses. Yep. We have a, an excellent startup training program where we take everyone into what we call our boot camp to get them started over a nine day period. Right. And then we continually work with them on uh, weekly conference calls. We have a news forum on our website for licensees. So licensees actually help each other. Right. If one licensee in Melbourne's got a, a dentist for a client and another licensee gets a dentist for a client, they can help each other with what and, they're and done. And share information. Yeah. Yeah. So look, whether people today perhaps have got a small to medium business and they know that it could be, you know, bringing home more bacon than it is, uh, or whether someone's interested in perhaps, you know, looking at becoming a licensee, what's the best approach? What should we do? Yeah, just um, go to our website and log on, right. uh, or give us a call on the on the one on the zero eight hundred number that you've got there in front okay, of you, Alice, right. and uh, we'll get back to them. Um, we're pretty selective with who we take on board. Obviously. We do require some commitment from our from our clients, both our clients and our licensees. But generally, we've got an information pack that we can send out. All you've got to do is log on to our Excellent. website, which is listed on the screen, okay. and, and we'll send you out send the info from there. there. That's wonderful. And in case uh, you haven't got that uh, website handy, it's www.ribi.biz forward slash TV, or check out the 0800 number 20800 305 380.